Ah, what's up, hustlers? I had a really, come on in. I had a really uh, long night last night, but you know we, we wake up early, early in the morning and the grind never stops. Come join me outside. Outside, come on, come on. Becoming basically an A-list celebrity such as myself, I've really had to try and diversify my ways of making income. And that's why I started the Sigma Grind Set by ZT69420.com. If you go to Sigma Grind Set ZT69420.com, you too can learn how to have a successful drop shipping business, how to start a copywriting business, how to sell things off of Amazon and basically rule the world. I make tens of dollars per day off of what I do uh, simply because I know how to grind, okay? Went out really late last night, absolutely crushed the clubs, girls, cars, you name it, and I'm up way in early in the morning on my grind. What are you doing? doing back squats, some heavy kettlebell swings, and then some accessories for leg strength, which I'm excited for, and then conditioning after. It's a busy day. I'm trying to be more well-rounded in my training because I'm cutting a little bit. There's gonna be conditioning aspects, but it's just a lot of volume, which is something that I need. So I'm gonna work really hard right now, and hopefully it inspires you guys to do the same. about this programming is we have this strength block and then we do our like accessories but we mix in zone two cardio with it so you're not sprinting through it like you would like a wad for crossfit you're taking your time you're doing your movements and then you mix in a little bit of cardio as well you just kind of keep that zone two intensity and you can work just as hard on your accessories Austin Airport, about to fly to Miami for Wadapalooza. Now it's a pretty weird name, Wadapalooza. It's kind of corny, but it's a cool event. It's like probably, I think, the, the biggest CrossFit event, bigger than the CrossFit Games. And even though I'm not particularly a CrossFitter, um, it's a really good place to meet up with some, some really awesome people. I've got some really cool podcasts lined up and some good collaborations. I'm excited. Uh, we're gonna get picked up by my boy uh, Marcus Leone. He's been in um, previous videos that I've done with uh, Juju Mufu. Super strong guy. We're gonna go to Hybrid, which is where uh, Hayden Bow is at, and then we're gonna be uh, this person dancing right here. And then we're gonna go uh, podcast. So, like, literally, I'm getting picked up. We're going straight to a podcast. And then who knows from there. Sweet boy. Boy! There you go. We're live with uh, maybe the most interesting man in the world of fitness right now. <laughs> You've been, you've been on hard, it's so established, it's so like the CrossFit gym. Yeah. I just did a podcast at Hybrid with Hayden. Now we're gonna go eat, meet up with Jordan Shallow and Blaine McConnell, who is an absolute beast athlete.
Ending the night tonight. Um, tomorrow, podcast, see you. Uh, we're gonna go do a little bit of work and then podcast for my show. And then uh, have a little training session. I'm actually really excited for that. Let me in! So we're back at Hybrid to record in that studio. Waiting on Jordan right now, but I'm gonna do a podcast with Jordan Shallow. So if you guys don't know, I have a podcast, it's called Come Correct. I've had Derek from More Plates, More Dates on there. I've had Mark Bell, Mark Henry, Nick Bear, a lot of big names. I'm, I'm getting Matt Fraser on uh, on the show. So check it out, go to Come Correct, Come Correct on YouTube, just search Come Correct Podcast, or you can search it on any streaming audio sites. So yeah, we're gonna get into the podcast right now and then do a workout. Um, and it seems like the breadth of, for instance, Andrew Schultz yeah. is a really interesting one. Can you tell us about that? Just got done podcasting with Jordan at Hybrid Gym. I'm with good friend, Blaine. If he had continued CrossFitting, would absolutely be the strongest CrossFitter. The, uh, right? Yeah. Snatch, uh, snatch 150? 155. 155 snatch, clean and jerk. 195? 195. I don't think those numbers are being hit by any elite CrossFitter right now. Uh, it's a super explosive athletic dude, dabbled in bobsled, can jump out of the gym, incredibly explosive. So it's like something that I, I don't see too often. I see a lot of strong guys in, in CrossFit, but not guys who have just pop, and that is Without a question, Blaine. What's your Instagram? Story Poppy, right? Yeah, Story Poppy. Yeah, it's Icelandic for Big Daddy. Big, is it really? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so he currently lives in Iceland. Definitely check him out. Today, we're just gonna power clean. I'm hoping he can just power clean something big and we can just make it look cool. Let's do it. All right, no warm up straight into 60 kilos. And then we're just adding 10 kilos until one of us drops off. Don't do this at home, kids. Uh, really, y'all don't know this, y'all in danger, I'm a threat I'm a threat Gamble with your life, cause you know that it's okay It's okay You know I ain't letting up, my foot is on your neck yeah. Take my word for it, it's a promise and a threat oh, yeah. Really, y'all don't know this, y'all in danger, I'm a threat I'm a threat Gamble with your life, cause you know that it's okay It's okay You know I ain't letting up, my foot is on your neck yeah. Take my word for it, it's a promise and a threat go. I ain't never really wanna flex my gifts, but I think it's my time it out. Good. Yeah, it works. <laughs> <laughs> Eyes watering a little bit. I am a avid smelling salt user. When I was bobsledding, 
I would be on the line and just like crack it, stick it right under my nose and just until my eyes started watering and then just throw it off to the side. They just fucking yeah! rip a sled off the ice. Dude, bobsled is so fucking cool. Bobsled is like the hardest, like you get no money, zero. No one knows who the f you are. Nope. It's just energy. Those guys are psychos. Absolutely. I don't need your money. You can pay me your respect. Once I do it, you can follow with the check. I need your honey bags. Nothing more, nothing less. Hey! That's the video, assholes. If you don't know who the f Blaine McConnell is, you do now. Big Daddy, translated into Icelandic, is Story Pobby. Find him. Follow him. We're out.